This WordPress tutorial by Mark McLaren of McBuzz Communications is called How to Position an Image and Wrap Text Around an Image Using WordPress. Uh, this is considered an intermediate tutorial because one of the ways to do this is to use the code editing window and work with the HTML code. But first I'll show you an easy way to get this to happen. Um, here's what we're talking about. I've inserted an image in this example post and you can see that the image itself is aligned flush left, aligned to the left, and the text wraps around to the right. Okay. In this case, uh, the second case, the image is aligned flush right and the text wraps around the left. Now if you just pop an image in um, at the beginning of a, of a paragraph using WordPress, you're going to see something more like this, where you get a whole bunch of white space and the text begins sort of at the bottom of the image. Okay, This is still aligned flush left by default, but the text doesn't wrap around. Okay, so what, what's an easy way to, to correct this? Um, show you how we do this. I'm going to go ahead and insert an image here at the beginning of that paragraph, that first paragraph. Okay, pop that in comes in kind of big so I'm going to reduce the size by holding down the shift key and dragging the lower right corner. Okay, so that's set up in there and it would look like this if I just saved it right now. But all you need to do, click on the image to select it and then click on the insert edit image button here. It looks like a little tree. And you get a dialog box that pops up. And one of the options, see if I can blow this up a little bit, is alignment. Okay, and right now it's not set. It actually aligns, like I said, to the left by default. But if you set the alignment to the left, okay, and then click on update, the text wraps around the right side of the image. Okay, Now that will look better. Let's check it out. Okay, I'm going to preview. That preview link is, is not part of uh, earlier versions of WordPress, but it's in version 2.3. Okay, you can see that the text now wraps around to the right but there's no space between the text and the image okay which makes it very hard to read and it doesn't look good it doesn't look professional at all uh, so what can we do about that well there's another f option in the insert edit window dialog box if you go back and click on the image click on that button you can see that vertical space and horizontal space are two options here. So if I set horizontal, that's the space on either side of the image, to about 15. Click on update. Okay, I've got this blown up. I've got the text enlarged so you can see what I'm doing. Click on save and continue editing and then go preview. Okay, now I've got a good amount of, of space between the text and the image. All right, But you can see that there's also space on the left side of the image, which doesn't look that great um, from a design standpoint. If it doesn't bother you and it doesn't bother your readers, then, you know, great, you're all set. Um, if there was not enough space below the image, I could use the vertical space to put some air 
there between the text and the image. Okay, here I don't need to do that. Uh, something else that does happen, though, I should mention, if you put that vertical space on, in the same way as the horizontal space goes on either side of the image, not just one. Okay, I'm updating and saving. Preview. Okay, I put a little more space just to show you what this does below the image. I didn't really need it in this case, but you'll notice that there's also space up above the image, which really starts to look bad. So you, you would prefer, um, from the standpoint of good design, to have the image itself aligned with the top of the paragraph up here, the first paragraph, and to have the left side of the image aligned with all this text down below it, but it's not. So that's the limitation uh, right now for WordPress using that insert edit image dialog box. Uh, okay, what's the more um, refined way to do this with uh, a little more control? Well, it looks like this. Okay, first I'm going to take these uh, features off and put this back to not set and take out those values. Okay, so we back to, we're back to uh, the way it was. All right. Now, the the way to do this is to use the code editing window for the HTML that relates to this image. Okay, um, it's really not that bad. So let's have a look at at how this goes. Okay, I'm clicking on the code tab here, and now you can see I've got a whole bunch of uh, HTML in here, along with my text, you know, for the for the paragraph uh, or paragraphs. Here's what I really need. I don't need to look for anything else other than this IMG that corresponds to the image that we're dealing with. Okay, and after that IMG, I'm going to insert one more space in there. So I've got two spaces. Let's see if you can see this two spaces. I don't want to butt right up against this SRC. I want a space after, or a space before that. And I want to have the um, the code which I've included in my Business Blogging 101 post. So let me see if I can find that for you. That is not it. Sorry, brief advertisement. Go away. Okay. Momentary panic here. All right. Here's what I want to do. Open that. And go get the code. That is part of the Business Blogging 101 under WordPress tutorial how to position an image and wrap text around an image. Okay. Down here, you can see there's a little bit of code in blue. I'll pump that up so you can see it easily. Now unfortunately you can't just uh, copy and paste this in. You have to type it in. This is a kind of a quirk right now in, in uh, WordPress. But never fear. Okay. So we're going back to IMG here. And we're going to type in this code, if I can get it to set up properly. Okay, here's what we're going to type. Style equals. Wouldn't it be nice if I could just copy and paste, but I can't. Oops. Okay, you get the idea. And float. This is what's going to align the image to the left. Okay, float left. You can put a space in here if you want. Okay, let's just do that for now. You can see that uh, down below here, 
there is a padding right and a padding bottom. Okay, so you could type those in as well. I'm just going to stick with that for now. So that's in the code editing window. I'm going to go click on save and continue. And preview. And there you go. You've got it aligned to the left. Text wraps around to the right. If you insert those padding right and padding bottom values, those will put space on the right side and the bottom of the image, but not on the left and the top where you don't want it. Okay? Give those a try and uh, send me a comment if you've got any questions.